This has happened to me too many times. I got ready to use my propane burner, and when I turn it on, look at the flame. It ain't nothing I can do to adjust it, and the problem is, is how I got it stored. You know, if you guys like me, I just leave mine outside for months at a time, and I leave it on my patio, and my patio is uncovered. So you got rain, and you got bugs, and spiders, and everything. They get in, and they do some damage to these burners. So if you ever have this happen, either you're going to have to clean it, or you're just going to have to buy a little replacement burner. And I think you can get these for maybe $15, $20 there at your Lowe's or Home Depot or you can look in the description below but let me show you what you can try to do if that's the case if you don't have access to a car or you just want to do a quick fix but you take those two screws out and then you get you a wrench and take this fitting off and you probably got to spray some WD-40 on it to get this thing lubricated but once you take that off as you can see in this one it was clogged all up you know I had a, a wasp nest and I've had some paper and all kind of stuff that was inside this vent as you can see right there I don't know what that is but uh, it was inside the vent and as you can see it's got a lot of rust and trash and everything so what you can do is make sure you put some safety glasses on you see I don't have any but make sure you put some on and you blow this thing out or you can run water through it but then let it dry for about an hour if you run some water through it then you put this fitting back on and give it a try and that might fix the problem but the best way to store this thing I'm gonna show you it fixed it this time on this one I'm gonna go ahead and light it I'm gonna show you how this burner looks and you see that's what kind of flame you want you want a blue flame you don't want no yellow or orange looking flame this is what you want right here and that was a quick fix because I didn't feel like going to the store and purchase another one but if you are going to leave this thing out and on the patio the best thing you can do is take your burner and turn it upside down so that the rain would not get into the holes and orifices and stop everything up and you got a better chance of it working correctly if you do that so just take it and turn it upside down if you're going to leave it there for months at a time and you got a better chance of it working correctly when you get ready to have that big crawfish ball or boar shrimp alright if this video helps subscribe to my channel and thank you and have a great day